and welcome to this week's ASFN News Flash. Remember that you can now become part of the ASFN community with three different membership options to choose from. Simply visit our website at www.asfnfishing.com and choose your option. Also remember that the ASFN apparel is now available and to send your catches to Grand Elite at asfn.co.za. Without further ado, let's get right into this week's ASFN News Flash. We kick start this week with Nigel Chetty who caught two beautiful copper breeds one of 2.2 kilograms and one of 2.5 kilograms. These fish were caught on his Dawa Sweep Fire and 15 pound Kingfisher Giant Abrasion and he used an Adcan prawn tail. And then Jonathan James managed to hook into some nice sized bass at a private dam on a farm in Limpopo. These fish were safely released back for the spawn. On the south coast, Safar Adam got stuck into a 9 kilogram garrick. And this he got done using his Dawa Grand Wave, 20 pound looking fish, a giant abrasion, and a plug. Congratulations. On the ambassador side in Richards Bay, Dean Reddy also got tight with some garrick using his Grand Wave 30 and 0.45 Kingfisher Giant Abrasion. Michael Roger also climbed in under the fish, getting a diversity of species, of which some beautiful snook using an anchovy spoon and a silver spoon. These fish were caught using his Dawa BG 4000 Max Seal, 11.6 power spin, and 15 pound chartreuse J braid. It's all yellow bellies and catface rock arts for Linton Premlau up north. Linton got these spectacular fish using his Saltus 15 foot, his Saltus 6500 and 40 pound Dawa J braid. Ryan Matheson managed to weigh in a couple of carp using his Corda gear. Ryan used a hybrid spinner rig with Corda SARS 2 crank and a heli safe lead system. Well that wraps it up for this week's ASFN News Flash. Remember to keep those catches coming to Grand Elite at asfn.co.za. That is Grand Elite at asfn.co.za. Remember to subscribe to the channels and to hit that little bell icon if you would like notifications of when new content is getting loaded. We'll see you next week. Goodbye.